Hi, I'm Kim with Us Born Books and More. Right now, I want to talk to you about some of my favorite books that we carry, and they are non—they are nonfiction, but I classify them almost by themselves because they are flat books, and I also call those our one-finger books. So right here, we have the Look Inside series. That's some of our younger flat books outside of the peak insides. So this one is a look inside space. And as you can see right here, you can find more information. So it starts with a really broad concept up here. And then it gets more concrete as it goes down into the flaps right here. And this one, I love that it uses layers within layers or flaps within flaps really fun title. We also have a look inside body that is actually one of my favorite body books that we have outside of our new title, uh, The Big Book of Body. Um, look Inside Food is another look inside book. We have Look Inside Castle, Look Inside um, Airport, just some really fun titles like that. And next we have our See Inside books. This right here is actually one of my best sellers, See Inside Universe. So it uses some really gorgeous illustrations. And then the flaps, of course. So again, you have your, your big, broad concept. And then as it gets smaller and into the flaps, it becomes more concrete. So the flaps really do help with learning as well. They help to cement the, learn, the thing being learned into the mind of the child with the flaps. And the kinesthetic movement of doing the flap just really helps with learning as well. So that's our C Inside series. There's several of those as well. Um, and then we have, oh, there's also C Inside Body right here which again, um, that's actually a really hot seller too. A lot of people just love this book right here. Talks about the whole system, where the food goes when you eat it. <laughs> the Look Inside Body, again, um, like the Look Inside Space, has flaps within flaps, which I really like. Now, our Lift the Flap series right here, this is Times Tables. I really like that, and you could easily pair it with our new Times Table activity book. Times Tables are one of those things that you still need to memorize. You still need to memorize them to help with speed when you're doing math, a higher level math. Um, another lift the flap is computer coding. And then um, another one that I really like, and I, I like to really tell my homeschoolers about this, is Lift the Flap Art. So it goes through some of the classic artists right there. Pair this with some of our art books, and you have a really good art curriculum. And then one of my favorite ones I discovered purely by accident, Lift the Flap Picture Atlas. Great, if I can face it right, goes through the entire earth, you know, the, the continents. Make sure I'm facing them right. But what's really awesome is the map right there. That is a fold out map that you can put on your wall and have fun with. So anyways, I just really wanted to highlight those kind of all by themselves because of the value that they do have towards learning and encouraging learning and reading. It's all literacy. All those little bites are still literacy for our kiddos. Anyways, shh, talk to me about the one you like the best that I showed you or another one that you've seen on the website. Post it below in the comments. Talk to you soon.